Hello everyone, I'm Miguel Sanchez, and thank you for coming. Welcome to Moshi Monsters Biography. Glad you, glad you came along for the ride, and we're proud you're here. So yes, we are just about ready to bring you our next character, and this one is a crab. Wow, a crab living in Monstro City? Yeah, I know it. But is this crab really, really worth it? Hmm, we may never know, but we're going to find out right now. So thank you for coming, and uh, believe me, you are definitely in for one hell of a ride. If you're promising you're like this, you you know this is definitely the right place for you. So thank you for coming, and this is Emoji Monsters by Agave. We're going to have a lot of fun, but this tiny little crap we're going to take a look at right now. So let's begin. Guy, okay, here we go. All right, we're on episode 228, and as we take a look at Little Crab 1. Wow. I love the sound of that, but we don't know what this little crab could do, so let's see what little crab one can do. And for those who have not seen our previous episode, which was episode 227, taking a look at the chief of the ice cream hoodoos, which was... Little Chief Two Scoops, I'll leave a link to that on the top right corner of the screen. The info is waiting for you to go watch right now. Go check it out right now. But now, we're not wasting any more of your time here. Let's just go ahead and jump right into the story. And let's see what else we let's see what Little Crab One can do. Got it? Good, here we go. Alright, so who is Little Crab One? Little Crab One is a character in Moshi Monsters. They are one of the three crabs that live in Crabby Cove. Together with Little Crab Two, they collect decoration ornaments that that they both refer to as treasures. So see Little Crab One's game finishing the game of finishing joke finishing the jokes, they agreed to give you the ornaments to decorate Big Crab's new home. And with both voicing they hope you put their stuff to good use. Oh, that's all I gotta say. That's pretty much it. Game to the character says here, name is name is Little Crab One, occupation, collecting treasure at Crabby Co. They beat it in season three, mission three. The Kuga Heist and the relations include Little Crab 2 and Big Crab. And of course, about Little Crab 2, I will talk about him in the next episode of the series. Yes, that's right, the next episode will be about Little Crab 2, so please stay tuned. It's, it'll come out later today. As for Big Crab, um, I'm not sure. Uh, 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 he's not in the characters section of the Moshi Monster Wiki, but I'm not going to talk about him. But if, uh, but, if, but, if, if, but if he was included in the character section, then I'll, uh, I'll talk about that in a future episode of the series. Perhaps maybe at the end of the series. So, yeah, pretty much it. Moving on to the personality, Little Crab One is the more is the more playful and careless one of the crab couple. Even though having collected decorative ornaments with Little Crab Two and hearing their displeased when they're being requested to give away their treasure, they simply refer to Little Crab Two as being crabby and offer Super Moshi the treasures if they correctly finish their joke with punchlines. Although all their all their jokes being negative towards crab kind. They only show being uncomfortable with the final punchline that claims that crabs steal. This might have to do with the mission itself, where you accuse specifically the big crab of stealing the Guggenheim. Ouch, that is going to hurt. No good. Uh, and finally for the design, both the little crabs have a similar design to Herman Crab, only differencing being the house on top of them. Uh-oh. Hmm, Herman Crab, huh? Well... Hoop de doo, looky doo. Herbert Crab was already discussed in a future episode. Her Herbert Crab was discussed in a past episode of the series. Herbert Crab was discussed on uh, on episode 174 of the series. So please go to watch. If you haven't seen it yet, please definitely go do so. Um, they both have a straw roof beach house as their shell slash home or differing design. Little Crab One has a more hut like design with no clear idea of an entrance. Oh boy, that's nothing else to say about here. But that's it for Little Crab 1. Let's get to the final answer even together. Mm, little Crab 1, not much to say. 50 50 yes, 50 50 no. But in the end, definitely not one. Not much to say about here, but we'll, we'll get to the bottom of it when we get to. For now, for, for now, I'm going to have to rate Little Crab 1 with a score of 5 out of 10. Average character, not much to say about here, but in the end, no much to worry about here. Little Crab 1 is a 5 out of 10. But that's only my personal conservative opinion. Feel free to agree with your thoughts and opinions in the comment section down below. With that, my guys, we're done. Thank you for watching another episode of Moshi Monsters by Agave. Taking a look at Little Crab 1. Make sure you check out some other cool videos you see on the channel. And make sure you stay tuned for another new episode later on today. Again, no Severian Kid Origins today. But don't you know where it will return right before you know it. So please, stay tuned. But for that, we're out of time. Thank you for watching. I'm Miguel Sanchez. You'll be yourself. And I will see you next time on Moshi Monsters Biography. Come back later when we take a look at at the second little crab here. We uh, this episode we took a look at little crab one. Next episode we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna take a look at little crab two. Wow, we can't believe it. So that'll be the subject for the next episode, which will be episode two hundred and twenty nine. So please stay tuned for that episode. You do not want to miss it, and hopefully you you, you, you won't yeah, be seeing here.
All right, coming to be dogs. But what up, guys? We're out of time. Thanks for watching. I'll be guys I'll see you for Littlecraft 2 very, very soon. Until then, please remember to leave a like, share this video with your friends, leave a comment down below, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Also, turn on notifications to not miss a new video. Yeah, please, please, please subscribe to my notifications. Turn on to not miss another new video for me as we're on the road to 500 subscribers. But with that being said, thank you for watching. You take care of yourselves. I'm Miguel Sanchez, and I love you all so much. Peace out. Like, share, subscribe. See you in another video. Laters.